Yo guys, it's your boy Nogginator here. Uh, sorry for the audio quality. I'm literally recording this on a potato. So this is a Forza Horizon 5, I'm guessing, uh, concept map. And it is in Japan. As you can tell, this thing is huge. Uh, sorry for that. Uh, we have a lot going on here. Uh, you know, we got the Horizon Festival. A lot of cool roads. I'm kind of just going to break down a few things. So let's start off with the Horizon Festival here. This kind of looks like a Horizon Festival. You got that long little road here that kind of looks like it would be part of a drag strip. Uh, but a lot of this is about the roads. So right next to the dra or the festival, I already see a huge drift mountain. As you can see by the uh, texture, it is definitely a mountain there. And it looks like it is a dirt drift road that starts down here towards the bottom or ends there and goes all the way up through uh, a lake here as well. And so this looks like it'd be pretty fun. We uh, go down, everything is kind of windy roads as you can see, uh, just because of the whole mountain aspect of Japan. But here we have Fuji, which is, uh, I could I could very well climb this. As you see, we got the dirt road coming through here. Look at all these different little points of you can literally drift or just go up this entire road and then at the uh, plateau of it here you can go and then you can go down again so more squiggly roads as you go through here this is your second horizon festival you just look at all the roads that are around here and this is probably an unrealistic amount of roads but i <laughs> it looks really fun we got the little festival spot right here uh now I kind of want to look at different areas. This area, uh, I'm going to pronounce these names terribly, uh, Hiratsuku, let's not save that, uh, looks like almost a beach here. Uh, just a little special area, nothing crazy, but uh, area of something. Looks like we are going to be able, I say we like this is an actual thing, but according to this, we'd be able to drive along the coast pretty much the entire way then we got uh shimoda which is another little i wouldn't say it's a little city but it's got a lot going on to it uh looks like a main kind of interstate going through and then bordered by a river that goes into a delta then this is your other horizon festival now this one looks fun because it's kind of on the edge kind of almost like a byron bay from horizon 3 uh, it looks like you can go around the outer edges here as well, and this is more of not a, like, city for the festival or, like, kind of close-in area. This is more of just, like, kind of an open space for the festival. Uh, now let's go to Kanagawa, I guess that's how you pronounce it. This is basically just a huge mountain to drift on, as you can tell. We got the area here with for the smaller mountains. We got more over here for the bigger mountains. This part looks fun. This map could just be full of drift zones. What can I say? Then we got Hakone here. <laughs> I'm probably pronouncing these wrong. It's probably like Hakone or something. You know, if you know these, just comment them below, please. Uh, but once again, more of a mountain to drive on. Then we have Lake Ashi or Ashi. And this... There's, these lakes are always in Forza. You have the areas where, you know, this bar right here probably is going to be a barn find. You got a little bit of uh, building around there, and then the rest is just around. Now, I want to point out some spots before we go to the main area. This is almost like its own little city in one. Shishibu uh, is what I'm going to call it here. It's a nice, like, development that's a mixture of dirt and tarmac. And this could even be another one of those festival sites, but it just looks really fun to be a part of. Uh, next, here is our, I believe, the last Horizon Festival, Kawakami. Uh, this kind of looks like it would be a long strip of road, and then it just branches out almost like a T. But then you can see you can take like the outer skirts here for more mountains. This just seems like... If you were to go into drone mode or something in this area, it almost like, I guess it would be like a Venice, or not really Venice, but like, you go into drone mode, all you see is mountains, but then you look down, there's like a city inside or under the mountains, if that makes sense. Uh, next off, we got another lake here, Haruna. 
uh, nothing crazy. This is the guy who made it, by the way, giving credit out here to Q Ravek. Make sure you give him uh, some nice feedback. Then we got the Gunma, and this is another Horizon Festival here. I believe Gunma is actually just a mountain uh, behind, but this, another city type of design, kind of looks like um, Surfer's Paradise a little bit, the actual, like, shape of it. Um... Then this this is just like another huge area of drift roads. <laughs> this entire map is just drift roads. There's a lot more here, but the main idea is this huge city of Yokohama. Uh, first off, you see we got everything. We got sporting uh, stadiums there, and we got different rivers going through a lot of main intersections. You see just a whole lot of stuff going on you got the yokohama docks maybe there'll be boat racing in forza and then the festival here this looks like a fun little interstate road we don't really see bridges and interstates that much in a horizon game uh then we got daioku futo uh i don't know why i'm trying to pronounce this like i'm spanish definitely this is japanese but this entire area of just be huge you can do rally races you can do street races you can do anything so this is just the map in total. It is absolutely huge. Once again, shout out to Kurevac here. Let me know your opinions on the map below. And yeah, thanks for watching this video. Make sure you share it because this could be huge for Forza Horizon 5. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.